Hey, 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 Uncle Mark in the mothership. Three string cigar box guitar. November rain, guns and roses. I do have a companion video for this. Sorry about the vocals. I cannot sing Axel parts. But uh, I wanted to put it out there to show you what could be done in a cigar box guitar. So without further ado, I'm going to play a little bit of this song and then I'll break it down. When I look into your eyes, I can see a lovely strain. Darling, when I hold you, don't you know I feel the same? Three strings, cigar box, guitar, what do we got? G, D, G, 42, 34, 24, they're wound, they're electric guitar strings. I'm playing through a Roland Mini Cube, and at the end of the lesson I'll show you those settings, and uh, so look forward for that. So, this song is in the key of F, and the way you find an F on a cigar box guitar is you take that D string in the center, and you go D, D sharp, uh, D sharp, E, F. You put your first finger there, and you put your ring finger on that C, that's the fifth fret, and your pinky on that C, and it looks like so. There's also an F here, and I'll show you a little bit how to use that F later. But that's just G, G sharp, A, B flat, B, C, C sharp, D, D sharp, E, F. Okay, so this is a great shape. It moves up and down the neck. So F, F sharp, and G. You're going to want this G shape. And that's a G, D, and a D. So it would look like 7, 5, 7. And your F would look like 5, 3, 5. So F. When I look into your eyes, 7th fret D, and then C. Each lyric does this sort of thing. F. When I hold you, D. Don't you know I feel C the same? And now it's going to change for two lines to a D, G, and a C. D. Nothing lasts forever when we both know hearts can change. We're going to do the same thing, D, G, and C. And it's hard to hold a candle, G, in a cold November rain, C. This D is really a D minor. But with three notes, one, two, three, we can't properly make a minor chord. A minor chord is made up of four notes. And so what we do is just make it implied. So just play a D and don't worry about a thing. It works itself out, don't you worry. But if you feel like um, getting extra credit every time you play, you put your pinky four frets up or a whole tone and a half on that note there. So a C minor would look like that, and a B minor, and an A minor, and a G minor, and a F minor, like that. So that's a D minor, but you don't need to do that. So we have F, D, and C twice. F, D, and C. And then we have D, G, and C twice. So that's how the lyric sections go, and there are three of them. The, the chorus is F and G, and that's it, F and G. So you're just going to take this F shape and go, Do you need some time? And slide it up a whole tone or two frets. On your own, oh, 
do you need some time all alone? Everybody needs some time on their own. Don't you know you need some time? You know, I'm just sliding back and forth all alone. All right, and that's the chorus section. Okay, so it's you're going to get uh, a bridge now, and the bridge is E minor, and you make an E minor with a B, an E, and an open string. It's hard to F, keep an open heart, C, E minor, F, D minor. Then it's E minor, F, C. Then it's E minor, F, G. Then there's a solo. Then there's the F, G, need some time on your own. Then there's another solo. And then there's another lyric, and you got the whole song right there. So I played it in my video, and this is the harder way. Um, and what I did was, is I played my F up here. So this is the more advanced part of this lesson. I played it up here and put my pinky on this A and went. So I did this. shapes what what am I doing up here so one I'm finger picking and I do have a, a, a lesson explainer on how I finger pick so please look at that playlist if that's what you're interested in but I'm focusing on this first string and this D string so upper G and and D string right here these two really focus on those and so these notes seem to mimic the vocals so uh, G minor chord and then I'm playing this C with this shape this shape is the same shape you used for F F F sharp G G sharp A B flat B and C so I'm up here doing it with these fingers and this is what I'm doing with it So I'm coming from here to here to here with the same shape. So this shape, this shape, and this shape. This C, by the way, is the same as this C, and it's the same as this C. Those are our three main shapes in the cigar box guitar tuned open G. So you have the bar chord, then you have this inversion, and that's just a different way of saying, ah, it's a different shape. So this would be 12, 10, 12, that's a C. And this is also a C. And this is 12, 10, 9. Okay, so a C chord, a little bit of theory, a C chord is made up of a G, a C, and an E. That's how a C chord is made. But since we only have three strings, we can make it this way. We can make it this way. We can make it this way. So there are three ways to make it. So I'm just making one shape and walking down to another shape. So C, and it looks like this. So I would be playing 12 and 10. I'm playing 10 and 10. And I'm playing 10 and 9. So it looks like so. So to start all over, I'm on F, bar chord on 10, my pinky on A, G 
F E D E F And that's the C note that I need within this shape. I'll do this one more time. Now, when I get to that note, I replace and make this shape, replace, make that shape, replace, and make that shape. So it looks like... As you can see, I do a lot of finger replacement. This is really a, a really slick way of getting to things. I need this note right here. I just grab the note. The note is the most important. Replace, move my fingers. Replace, move my fingers. Replace, move my fingers. Finger replacement is the best way to learn how to navigate these types of chords. So uh, that's how it goes. And then when I play everything else, I'm down here. It takes some time on your own, right? And my E minor, I play up here when I get to that bridge. So that's a nine, and I use the minor shape. We talked about this. It's a whole step and a half step. F, D minor. And that's how I play through this song. It's uh, very nice. We don't do the end of it where everybody needs somebody, don't you think, don't you, and all of that. I just kind of ended it at that, making it a very nice, uh, chill song. I want to thank you all so much for everything you do for me. This was a special request from somebody who, uh, who needed, to, needed some support. This is a special requests. So thank you so much for that. Um, I do have a PayPal link here down below. It's a paypal.me forward slash Uncle Mark Tips. Thank you all for everything you do for me. Uh, Buck a show is all we ask here. And I do have a Facebook page, Cigar BX Blue. Please take a look at that because I post a lot of live things here and there and things I'm not going to put on this channel. Uh, also, I told you I'd show you the settings so these are my settings on my mini cube, and uh, so I'm on that Brit combo. My gain is minimal, tone is dimes. I've got a little bit of reverb you can see there, and that's pretty much what it is. I'm using my X Vive. These little puppies here are just really, really nice. These little guys, I really, really do like them. They uh, they're really just a handy tool. They don't give me any money to tell you about this, but uh, they're a handy tool. I really, really like them. Thank you so much for everything you do for me. I really, really appreciate it. You're very generous and a loving community, so thank you so much. We'll see you again soon with more of your requests, so thank you so much.